Hello and welcome to the Stamp Camp. Today is Tuesday's Tip and Techniques Day. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to tie a faux square knot. So let's get started on this quick tip for you. So I have two cards here and both of these cards have the faux uh, square knot. On this card here, I'll show you this one first. This is what you call a Z-fold card, a very simple card to do. Um, I'm going to show you this faux part right here. So I reproduced this part of it. And then I have the chevron ribbon, which I cut about six inches. Now I'm going to come in with the Stampin' Up! stapler. And we just want to come in from the side here. And we're going to staple that just like that. Then what you're going to do is you're going to bring the top down to your right. And the left is going to come around and come through. And we're having our little faux square knot. Because the chevron is printed chevron on one side, and on the other side is the neutral. When you're pulling, just make sure that you pull up the side that you want showing. So on my sample here, I have the chevron showing. And on my card sample, I have the neutral background showing. So either side. And then just trim up your ribbon, however you like it. So that is your faux square knot. Super simple. Now to do it on this card right here, so it looks like you tied it around and then tied your knot. I'm going to take a piece of black and I'm going to take a piece of our white just so you can see it better. I thought with the white ribbon versus the black would be easier to see. We're going to pretend that we have that stamped on the front and we're just going to put a little adhesive on the back, put our ribbon, wrap it around to the front come back and stick it down on the back, and then trim. Now we're going to pretend that that is on our card front, just like this here. So then to do the faux square knot, just cut a piece of ribbon. And then because I want my bow, my faux square knot, to end up this direction, you place your ribbon the opposite way that you want it to go. So I'm going to find the center. I'm going to say that I want my faux square knot to be right here towards the top. I'm going to come in with the stapler again and staple that. So the top goes to your right. The bottom wraps around and comes through. And then you just square that up. Just kind of twist like this and you'll get that square knot. So it looks like you tied it around, but with the staple, you don't have to go through all the tying. So there you go. That is your faux square knot. Super simple. I'm sure you can do that. So here's my faux knots. Either a knot or wrapped around and tied. So that is your tip for today. Thanks for stopping by.